and uh, about your creative creative interests. Well, I'm currently studying in, in this old university. I'm studying the Portugal studies and doing my uh, psychology studies. And I have drawn all my life since I was a little girl. And uh, my current uh, drawing instruments, should I say, I use watercolors and pastels quite much, but also traditional pencils. And I have drawn paintings and portraits. Portraits is kind of my, my thing. Okay. And would you consider yourself to be creative? Uh, sometimes and sometimes not. <laughs> it depends on the day. Usually I can be quite creative, but sometimes it's quite difficult to get the get the inspiration out of me, should I say. Okay, so how would you define creativity? What creativity is? Uh, I think uh, that uh, for me creativity is the process when, uh, where I get my ideas transformed into a concrete paper and concrete picture. I think that shows my creativity. Okay, so how creativity occurs? Uh, I think it shows uh, in the ability that you can make something totally different than uh, any other art artwork. Mm, for example, when we are working in groups and we are painting the same picture, the same portrait, it shows that you interpret the, interpret the picture in a totally different way than my, my colleagues or, or my friends. And we, even though we are painting the same picture, the, all the artworks are totally different from each other. Yeah. I think it shows there. Yeah. And what do you think that what enhances creativity? Uh, I think that uh, creativity can be enhanced uh, in art, uh, in abstract paintings. I think the biggest problem in, in creativity is, is that you think about too, too much about what other people will say about your work and, and your working methods. So using an abstract painting uh, can help uh, to use your creativity in a most e e efficient way. Yeah. Uh, for example, I, I used to drench, uh, drench my uh, watercolor paper in water, so it's complete, completely wet, and then I just drop a pieces of, of uh, color there and see what it looks like, and then I started to create my painting from there. So I think that uh, can feed your creativity yeah. in the most efficient way. What blocks creativity? Uh, for me, uh, I think the biggest uh, block in the creativity thing is yourself. To think about what other people will say about your work and to transform your art according to that. I think it, it can block your creativity quite a bit. But when you get past that and just uh, try to do abstract work and try to enjoy the process itself, it can help a lot. So just do what you want and, and see what happens. That is the best advice. Yes. But do you think that creativity is something that can be learned or studied? Um, I think uh, it cannot be learned because I think we are all creative in our own way, but we all have a different size locks and different amount of locks that block our creativity and I think that we can learn to get rid of those locks so we can uh, free our creativity in the most efficient way. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. These were all my questions. So thank you for the interview.